welcome and welcome back to my channel guys this is JB23 vlog for today's video guys I would like to share to you how to take performance on MEB engine or the electronic engine type 6S 50ME-B 9.3 so as you can see guys this is the portable measuring chain in which the PMI calibration box I'm holding that PMI calibration box and the portable sensor and this calibration box is connected to the calibration junction box through the connector so this is used for offline or offline PMI offline guys so here it is just like that uh, you have to connect the connector of the portable measuring chain to the calibration junction box and the portable sensor to be connected on the calibration box the PMI calibration box then and the portable sensor to be inserted in the indicator cock so that's how it is guys first you have to bleed a little bit the indicator cock then connect the portable sensor you have to tight fully the portable sensor guys then after that you have to open the indicator valve once it is opened then you can press ok on the calibration box once it is pressed ok it will start recording the pressure diagram after 20 seconds the pressure diagram has been recorded then once it is completed it will shows again the start button that means that is completed or the data has been transmitted to the PMI monitor so after that just close the indicator valve and detach the portable sensor this how I did guys so again this is the, from unit number Four. as you can see guys I just press the OK button after pressing it will start reading the pressure diagram after 20 seconds the pressure diagram is been transmitted into the PMI monitor then just close the indicator valve just like that guys yes. so it is shown here the the junction box of the PMI and this is the connector of the PMI calibration box so just like that guys after that close so here I am at the unit number 4 or this is unit number 4 yes so the same procedure guys just tight fully the portable sensor and open the indicator valve so this is unit number 5 guys just press the button ok once it is pressed it will start recording the pressure diagram and at the same time it will be transmitted on the PMI monitor and after a few seconds the data will be saved and how do you know that it will be saved? The, on the monitor it will be shown as like uh, ready the calibration box shows ready so that means it, the, it will be ready for the next measuring on the next cylinder so I'm here at the unit number 6 now I fully open the indicator valve then I press the button OK after pressing the OK the same guys 
it will start recording the pressure they go as you can see once it is shows ready that means it is completed so we just complete the unit number one two six one so this is our main engine guys this is electronic engine MEB so we just complete the measuring of the cylinders case so this is the connector to the calibration junction box so this is the calibration junction box guys this is the connection of the offline PMI so here we come at the PMI monitor guys so after taking all the performance on all units then we have to save all the data guys so this is how to do it so just check that completed cylinders 1 to 6 has been saved just press next finish and then you have to input the date and the location so that uh, we can save the exact details on the wind and in what location and what sea condition and I mean the vessel conditions that we are taking the performance so we have to take manually also all the parameters when recording the performance including the fuel oil consumptions the cylinder oil feed rate and so on, exhaust gas tem temperatures, pressures, cooling system, and all this. So, this is the data that we input so that this is for the reference and for the records, also, that is required from the company and for the record keeping, also, guys. And for us, also, engineers that we must know that we must be aware fully aware that our main engine is fully operational or at its optimal performance guys so i am taking performance at the rpm of 85 rpm guys uh, at around 68 percent 68 percent load of the main engine so this so we are now saving guys and we, let's try to export the data that is taken today so this is the data guys we have to export it into the PDF form so this is how to do it guys just export into PDF form so it's already been saved the performance taken so it is so this is it now you have the pmax the compression pressures and the deviations it's everything is there guys and you have to read and fully understand and by the way this is uh auto tuning from it's different from another electronic engine that is uh, manual tunings but for this kind of engine guys the MAB this is uh, auto tuning so let's wait for the procedures to complete the saving saving procedures guys so this is how it is guys that uh, how to take performance so the frequency of performance guys is taken at every month or on a monthly basis you have to record all and the C condition just to get the optimum performance of the engine guys that the C condition must be calm or it's not be rough seas or should be smooth or camsis so that we can determine or we can justify the 
engine for its optimal performance so right now I'm saving the the exported files PDF files so from that point on we will have already the reference for us so we can monitor our engine parameters it is very important for us engineers that we must ensure that our engine is performed very well so here it is guys as you can see that's the performance curve of our engines so this is for our reference and for the record keeping and for the PMS also that's the compliance and our company procedures that we have to take and we must uh, record all the performance of the main proportion proportion engines so that's how it is guys it's very easy for us so we can determine the performance of engine so until here guys i hope you learned something about this video guys and this is jb23 vlog stay safe everyone bye bye